gate and drive right way. past him, and then I saw him park his bike over here. But I can tell the bike has all kinds of stuff hanging off of him. Where's your knife? Did you sent a few copy trespasser? I'm going to have a adult male. He's uh, intoxicated and he's going to be in custody at the time. This way. Take a seat. Take a seat. Hey, I'm back looking What's your name? Derek Marlowe. What are you doing here on campus? I just brought in with people, kids that I knew. You see some kids that you knew? Yeah. Where did you come in at? Just testing the system. You testing the system? Testing what system? You're testing what system? The kids. I teach the kids right now. Cool cat kids. You don't kids. teach here? No, sir. Mm. So what are you doing here? Just stop in. Hello. Good. Now you're under arrest. Okay. Uh, supervisor is definitely no yeah. good. Yeah. This is no good. Um, how how did you how did anybody see him get on campus? He was riding a bike. Yeah, the campus advisor said he rode up on a bike, and then the next thing you know, he was in. Uh, what what seat was that? Brinkerhoff. <coughs> yeah. Uh, Silver He walked right into Mr. Brinkerhoff's lab. Yeah, I know. Yeah. 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 Hey, Sarge. This is definitely Coco. Hey, not much. Uh, this uh, we basically have a um, an intoxicated male uh, that came on a campus today just now, and basically uh, oh, no, was able to get past it's all the security it's and walked into a few classrooms. I guess one classroom and started shaking hands with students, and then that's when we were called. And he's now in handcuffs right now. He's he's definitely under arrest. I'm, yep, you're telling me I'm I am extremely pissed right now. So no, it's a random person off the street. Yeah, home looks like a homeless dude, like legit. So he looks, he looks, and he's intoxicated. So, so he's under arrest right now. Oh, absolutely, we'll do. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna do trespassing on school grounds for for this arrest. How did you get on the campus? Huh? You're riding in where? Right the what the gate? Has arrived. The front gate. The front the gate. Yeah. Okay. No, you didn't. Yeah, did. Number one. No. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. No. No. Okay. Okay. So, so let me tell you this. Let me tell you this. This is this is Spruce Creek High School. This is a school. Great. I, I don't care. I don't care. Okay. Here's the thing. You trespassed on my school. Pay attention to me. You, you, you listen. And when I ask you to respond, you respond. Do you understand that? Okay. You came on to my school without authorization. You didn't check in anywhere. You didn't talk to anybody. You decided to come in on the campus, correct? You decided to come on the campus and shake some hands to kids, right? Is that what you were trying to do? Okay. And what entrance did you go in at? The one off Clyde Morris? The main one where there's a gate guard. Hey, how about you worry about yourself right now? Stop worrying about everybody else. Right now you're being charged. Okay? So, number one, you came on to a public school. I don't know that well. You don't know that well? Okay. Do you have any official business here? No, you don't. What kids? What? Who are they? You don't know them. They don't know you. No, they don't. Okay. Yeah. Oh, well, obviously they don't know you. Okay. They don't know you at all. You came in here without authorization. Without... What? What are you, what are you talking about? What are you saying? I made a mistake. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, you're going to jail. You're being arrested at this time. Okay, I have zero tolerance for this. You're going, you're going to jail. You threaten, you come onto this campus, and you threaten my students, or you startle my students, that's a big deal to me. You understand that? that that's a big deal.
What's your name? What? Spell it. Hey, what's up, Mr. Butler? So you saw him coming in? Yeah, I was trying to in. Where did he come in? The front gate. The front gate. Okay. You know, not like right by me, but the side where, you know, people leave. Yeah, the exit side. get off the bike. Where did he get off the bike? At the bowling alley door. I was like, I don't think this is a student. All right. So what I want you to do is I want you to fill out a statement of everything that you observed. Mm-hmm. So that way we can, you know, you tell me everything that happened in your words. Okay. Ms. Sullivan is the one that said, hey, listen, we got a trespasser. Yes. She, okay. But Ms. Sullivan was right there. Okay. She, was, she got there. From now on, here's, here's all I'm saying. If you know somebody or you have the inkling that this individual is not somebody who belongs here, give us a call, put it out over the radio, say, hey, someone check this guy out. I don't know who he is. doesn't look like a normal student. Here's what he looks like. Direction he's going, and we'll get there. Okay, don't okay. worry about calling Miss Fastmonte on the phone. Just put it out over the radio. We'll get we'll get guys responding. Cause myself and the Guardian, we're we're gonna make ourselves available for something like that. Because okay. this guy's coming on the campus. We don't know what he has or his intent. Right. And I gotta keep everybody safe. You know what I mean? Keep yeah. you safe. Because listen, uh-huh. he blew past you. And there's an intent there. Yeah. Because he didn't want to make contact with you because he wanted to come on the campus. Okay. So. That's why you had to call it out right away, right away, because guess what? As soon as he gets inside, I mean, I, I can't have that. You know what I mean? I can't have somebody, like, coming inside. I don't know what their intent is, and you know me. I'm a bulldog. Anybody who comes in this in this place, man, I, I got to know. You know what I mean? And I, I, I got to keep everybody safe, so you're good, man. All right.